What's up guys? Contrary to what you might think, this is not Northwest grown up. It is me, your girl, Hey Paris. What's up? <laughs> All right, so you guys know that I love to expose these Instagram fraud ass niggas because how dare you come on Beyonce's internet trying to start some shit and take people's account and then try to get their, their money out their accounts and shit like that. Like you ain't gonna do that under my watch. I'm gonna let the people know. I'ma let the people know, so I'm here to let you know. Wait, 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 wait. Before I tell y'all about the new scam going around the gram, I want to thank you guys from the bottom of my heart for a successful launch with my perfume, Slay with Rebel Sense. It was a success. We sold out in a total of three days, and that blew my mind. I was literally so surprised, excited, and I felt so loved. So thank you guys so much for that. Thank you guys so much for the amazing feedback. And I'm so happy so many of you guys already got your bottles. <sighs> feels like a dream so i just wanted to say thank you before i started this video because i need you guys to know how much you are appreciated okay but first of all let me tell you how i even came along this scam like they really tried it and the thing is about this scam in particular it can get a lot of people like a lot of people are about to get their instagram accounts hacked because of these people because it does not seem like a scam whatsoever at all okay so i got a message from one of my friends and this is a friend who calls me, talks to me, texts me on a regular basis, and she barely ever DMs me on Instagram. So when she DMed me and she asked me for my number, I was like, bitch, for what? Like, you, we were just talking yesterday afternoon. What do you, what do you, what do you mean what my number is? You know my number. You get what I'm saying? So I was kind of confused, but I'm not here thinking it's a scam. So I was like two seconds away from messaging her on Instagram DMs and being like my number is 647, yada, 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 you know what I mean? But instead, being the smart ass bitch that a bitch is, I decided I'm going to text her via iMessenger and be like, girl, this is my number, what's good? So when I texted her and I said, girl, this is my number, what's good? She replied back and she said, yeah, I know. Why are you telling me this, LOL? So I'm like, who's, who's jiggling my balls right now? Who is over here playing with my kitty cat? I don't understand what's going on. So I went over to Instagram and I screenshotted where she said, what is your number? And I sent it to her through text message. Like, who are you playing with? Like, you just asked me for my number on Instagram 2.4 seconds ago. What are you talking about? When I sent her the screenshot, she called me immediately. When I answered the phone, homegirl was bawling. She said, Paris, my Instagram has been hacked. I don't know how to get back in. I don't know how this happened. What the fuck? Like, she was in a panic and she's asking me, like, what should I do? Yada, yada, yada. Me personally, I'm so sorry, y'all. I do not know how to get back into a hacked Instagram account. I have no connections with Instagram or their CEOs or anything like that. I don't know who to contact. If my Instagram was to get hacked tomorrow, bye, hey Paris. I wouldn't know what to do. I would absolutely not know what to do. So I felt really bad and we were trying to figure out like what had happened and we could not figure out how someone got her password and was able to go inside of her Instagram account. So whoever asked me what my number was, was not her. It was a person who hacked her account, but we couldn't figure out how they got into her account, how they got her password, how they were able to DM. Like we didn't know what was going on. I was trying my best to figure it out with her. We could not understand for the life of us what happened. Fast forward to a week now, I actually got a message from one of you guys. One of my subscribers sent me this message. And I'm not gonna show her face, I'm not gonna show her username because she probably doesn't even know this happened because her account was also hacked. She said, I was trying to log into my Instagram page on my new page and they asked me to find someone to help me receive a link so I can get verified on my new phone. And I was sitting here like, first of all, hello to you too. Like, what are you talking to? You, just, you don't just send a message like that and they'll say hi to people. Like, what manners? And I was so confused because this person was following me, but I wasn't following them. But yet they were talking to me so casually as if we were cousins or besties or something. So I was like, why out of all people in my head? I was like, why out of all people, all the friends that you have that you know in real life, why are you asking me some random bitch on YouTube to help you get your account? But that doesn't make no sense. So I said back to her, I'm sorry, what are you trying to say? Like, I need some more information. Like, if I can help you, I will, but I don't know what you're trying to say. She said, I got a new phone and been trying to verify my Instagram account. They request for a friend to help me receive a link so I can get my account verified. Can you please help me? 
to my head, I'm like, please help you how? So I decided to go on her page and I see that she has like a million friends. When I say a million friends, I mean, she's posted up pictures with like a million different people. So I said to her, why are you asking me and not these people? And then I sent her screenshots of all of her friends because like, for real though, why are you asking me? And I kind of realized it was a scam right then and there because it wouldn't make sense for you to ask a stranger and not your friends. She replied back and said, friends refuse to help and some are not working. And wrong answer, you a fraud, you a scam. I thought it was her who was a scammer, but I later on found out that her account was also hacked. But I'll explain all that to you guys in a second. I replied back, I said, can't help, sorry. She replied back and said, what's your number so I can send you the link? That's when I put two and two together, okay? When your friend or family member gets hacked, these hackers then go through all of their followers and follow wings list and send everyone the same message, which is either what's your number, plain and simple, nothing else, just what's your number, or something more explanatory along the lines of, hey, I just got a new phone, but I can't log into my Instagram account, so give me your number, and when you get a code sent to your phone, give me that code so that I can log into my account on my new phone. Do you guys know where I'm going with this? So now if you answer this person and give this person your number, and mind you, this is going to be someone that you follow or someone who's following you. So they might be um, someone you're familiar with. So you're not going to think it's a scam. You're not going to think it's a scammer. You're going to think you're helping out your family or your friend until you watch this video. <clears throat> now, when you send this person that you think you know your number, they are going to try and log into your Instagram account by clicking forgot my password and using your phone number as a method to regain the password or change your password to a new password because they're going to say the code that comes to your phone send me that code so the code could be like 41326 whatever and now they have full access to your account because when they put your username your number the code that went to your phone they can now change your password and do whatever they want with your account i hope that made sense and now once they have access to your account they're going to do the same thing to you and your followings and your followers send everyone the same message what's your number and the scam just keeps going until they have access to everybody's mob instagram account okay now what do they do once they have your account bitch i don't know what they do for everybody but for my friend in particular, they were charging her 600 USD to get that account back. So they blackmailing your asses to get your account back. Lucky enough for my friend, she doesn't use social media as a money-making tool. It is She's not a social media influencer. It's nothing that she's too concerned about, you know what I mean? So she just went ahead and made another Instagram account. But for those of you guys who have businesses on Instagram or you are trying to take your Instagram seriously to make money or whatever the case may be, you gotta be smart. So I don't care if it's your sister, your grandmother, your mother, your brother, your uncle. I don't care who it is on Instagram. If they ask you what's your number, either don't answer them, text or call them yourself. Figure out if that's really them, but it's, it's probably not gonna be. Or what I did at the end of my conversation with that subscriber was what I did with the kidnapping scam. Y'all remember? I said, send me a voice note saying exactly what you just said. Send me a voice note so I know it's you. Why'd I get blocked? Why'd I get blocked for trying to help you by asking you to verify who you are by sending me a voice note? The scammer blocked me. And that's when I knew for sure it was a scam, okay? So if you didn't know, now you know. That's the scam. Don't give nobody your personal number, even if you think you know them, because it's probably not your auntie, your uncle, your cousin, or your best friend. You verify that shit via text message, okay? Not even text message. You know what caught him up? Caught him up and said, bitch, did you just ask me what my number is and I know it's saved in your phone? Is that what just had happened? Oh, okay, it was a scam I found so. So your Instagram account's gone? It's, it's gone for, for, forever? You should have watched Paris' video. She been exposing these scams. What you talking about? <laughs> Bye. Also, I was going to do a whole video on these cash app e-transfer Zelle scams on Instagram, but I think everyone's smart enough to know that no random person is going to DM you and be like, hey, I want to bless you with $500 for absolutely no reason today. Do we have to get into that? I don't think we have to get into that. I think we're smarter than that. I don't think y'all are falling for the messages on Instagram where people are DMing you talking about, my company's having a cash giveaway and I've decided you're the winner. 
Just send me your Cash App or your e-transfer or your Zelle account and I'm going to send you the money right now. I hope y'all not falling for that shit. I really hope y'all not falling for that. Or the best one I seen yet was someone who sent me an image of a number. It was like four, five, seven with a little bit of squiggly lines around it. And she said, if you could tell me what these numbers are, I will personally send you $700. So just to play with her, I sent her 12694 A B C D E F G H I J K L M N O P, okay? To see what she would say. And she said, uh-uh, that's not the right answer. Try again. You have 10 more chances. Bitch, 10 chances? What kind of contest is this? This ain't a contest. What you talking about? Yeah, you can't fool me, ho. You can't trick me. No, you can't. You can't do it. Anyways, guys, make sure you follow me on Snapchat, Twitter, Instagram. All that jazz is in the description box down below for your convenience. If you fell for this scam, I'm so sorry for you. But leave a comment down below and let us know how you got that account back. Or if you did. Because I don't know how to get that account back. If you know, let me know in the comment section down below. Okay? So I can, t so I can tell the people. Alright? If you know any other scams that you want me to go over on YouTube, let me know also in the comment section down below. Okay, guys? Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I love you guys so much. Don't gotta tell you twice, and I'll see you on the, the flip side. I'll see you on the flip side. My, my battery died. I'm sorry, y'all.